The hamstrings are a group of muscles located on the back of the thigh. Muscles of the hamstrings are semimembranosus, semitendinosus, the biceps femoris, the long head and the short head. The proximal end of the hamstring muscle originate from the ischial tuberosity of the pelvis. Here you can see the ischial tuberosity of the pelvis. Here you can see the hamstring come uh, from the ischium of the pelvis and it is close to the sciatic nerve and it is innervated by the sciatic nerve. The hamstring muscles are a major flexor of the knee and it help and have extension. Injuries to the hamstring muscles occur proximally and are a common source of chronic pain and injury in the athlete. What is the mechanism of injury? It often referred to as a hurdles injury. The athlete who attempt to clear the hurdles are prone to injury due to excessive hamstring tension. The hamstring strains, or we call it pulled hamstring, are classified into three grades. Minor tear within the muscle, partial tear within the muscle, and complete tear of the muscle. Most injuries of the hamstring will occur at the musculocutaneous junction, but the injury may also occur at the insertion into the ischial tuberosity. Severe hamstring injuries where the tendon tears away with a fragment of bone are called avulsion fracture injuries. This avulsion fracture typically is seen in patients who are younger, skeletally immature athletes. Clinical examination. Patient will complain of sharp pain in the back of the thigh with popping or tearing of the muscle, the doctor will find ecchymosis of the posterior thigh with palpable mass in the middle of the thigh. The injury is usually diagnosed by an MRI. Treatment. In case of strained or pulled hamstring, the condition usually occurs due to insufficient warm-up before activity. You will advise rest, ice, compression bandage, elevation, and physiotherapy. In case of avulsion injury, surgery is done in complete avulsion injuries with muscle retraction. Surgery is done early. We make an incision. We find the retracted muscle and tendon and protect the nerve. Use anchors in the ischium to repair the tendon to the tuberosity. In case of bony avulsion, screws may be used to fix the bony fragment to the ischium. Here is a case of a patient that have avulsion of the hamstring. The patient was repaired with multiple anchors to the ischium due to the size of the patient.